the upcoming Kick-Ass reboot is further along than most people realized. As Matthew Vaughn recently confirmed, the first film is called School Fight, and it's also been completed. They finished shooting it and are almost done shooting the second film, which is called VRAM. Ever since Matthew Vaughn's X-Men First Class debacle, and I think that's the best way you can call it, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's an absolutely insane story where he was given half the time that he was told he was allowed to have to cast everybody, to write the thing, and to shoot it, and they cut his budget by 40%. It's a miracle that he was able to pull that film off. And we know he works like a wizard when it comes to how fast he produces things. Almost like a modern day slash newer version of Robert Rodriguez. Gets in there, shoots it, gets it in the can, moves on. So the man clearly knows what he's doing, and this is further evidence. He recently revealed the first film for the new Kick-Ass reboot. It's done. We shot it. School Fight is done. And then he says, well, the second film, yeah. We're halfway through shooting that, and we're going to move on to the third film. So the second film, which is titled The VRAM, is in production. And I honestly think that this is great that they're committing to this right out the gate and realizing that we can't take three, four, five years between sequels, even like two and a half to three years, because everybody's going to grow up. That was a major issue with the first film to the second film. And understanding that you just need to commit to it and then see what happens, put your best foot forward, produce it, and then if they're successful, you can make more after the first one or second one is out in a more rapid pace. This all is exactly what you need to do. And this was a major problem that we always talked about when it came to Sony's films for Spider-Man and DC's for the DCEU. They were reactionary. Put one out, get feedback, then write the reactions in there, try to pivot, and then it took forever to get sequels out. They're ahead of it. So all good things coming at us from Kick-Ass by the sounds of it. 